Happy Pokemon 25th anniversary, guys. It is finally the weekend. I hope you've all had an amazing week so far. I'm Ray Kayin, and welcome back to another Pokemon card opening video. Guys, we have managed to get our hands on something super, 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 super special. I don't need to tell you guys how incredibly rare Pokemon cards are these days, uh, especially the newer set which was released about a week and a half ago called Shining Fakes. Guys, if you don't know how difficult it is to get your hands on these at the moment, here is a super sad flashback of me trying. Alright guys, after months of patience and searching and sadness and tears and a little bit of that Ryan luck, we have managed to find the one and only Shining Fates Elite Trainer Box. Alrighty guys, before we jump into the card opening, I believe I may have possibly, maybe, made you guys a promise at the start of the week to drop some Pokemon knowledge on you guys every single day this week, as it is Pokemon's 25th anniversary week. Woo! All right, so guys, here is Ryan's random Pokemon fact of the day. All right, guys, so apparently Farfetch was actually supposed to have an evolution in line. It kind of resembled a swan, and it went by the name of Madame, so Madame Swan, if you will. It's kind of mind-blowing if you think about it. All right, without babbling on any further, here we go. Awkward Pokemon card openings with Ryan. Honestly, how wet? Damn it. Okay, I don't want to damage the box here. Mm, okay, bear with me guys. Alrighty guys, here we go. If we open it up from the side here, and hopefully you guys should be able to see this. I'm trying to make it as clear as possible on my dodgy camera tripod setup over here. Alright guys, this might take a while, so I'm gonna cue some I'm gonna cue some light-hearted music in the background. Go! And just as I say that, we managed to open it perfectly fine. All right, guys, here we go. Let's open up the Shining Face Elite Trainer Box. If you didn't get a clear view of the box, here we go. I mean, look at that beautiful artwork inside. All right, guys, so for those of you that don't know, Pokemon Elite Trainer Boxes usually come with quite a lot of Pokemon cards and goodies. All right, guys, so that is basically the gist of what we're getting in here. Alrighty guys, here is the Shining Face Player's Guide. So we will have a quick browse through the cards in the set. So we've got all your common cards here. And guys, these are the big hitters right here. I'm going to flash on screen here some of the cards we are hoping to pull from these booster packs today. Here we go. Alrighty guys, so we have the card sleeves, which look absolutely gorgeous. I mean, look at that Eevee design right there. We have our energy cards with a fist bump energy on top. Yeah, Pokemon TCG dice. We have the Pokemon TCG counters right there. We have a few EV card dividers right there. I mean, again, love the design. We have the Pokemon trading card game rules book right there. I will probably flick through that at some point in the future. We have the co-card for you guys, but be quick about it. And guys, there we have the EV VMAX promo card, which comes with the Elite Trainer Box, and that looks 
absolutely insane. Alrighty guys, here we are. Here is the main attraction of the Elite Trainer Box. We have the Pokemon Booster Packs. I mean, the artwork on the Shiny Fates Booster Packs are absolutely incredible. We've got Shiny Corviknight, we've got Shiny Toxtricity, we've got Shiny Dragapult, and of course, I was kind of hoping that Charles would be there. That kind of ruined that, didn't it? And of course, we have the legendary shiny Charizard, which we are hoping to the Pokemon gods we can pull from one of these packs today. All right, guys, so we have 10 booster packs all together. So I am going to start now. All right, guys, we're going to start with a Corviknight. And of course, we are going to end on a Charizard because why not, right? Okay, so I've gotten a little bit better at these card openings, as you can see here i definitely have improved Alrighty, guys as you can see i have opened the first pack of pokemon cards perfectly without the use of any assistance or scissors whatsoever all right we have the code card for you guys all right i believe the card trick should be the same as always so we'll go un de trois four from the back and we are going to guess the energy guys let me know in the comments down below what energy you think we are starting off with i'm gonna go with a fire energy okay we're not off to a great start an electric energy we have a float tool again love the artwork on these cards it is ridiculously good we got tropius we got a gym trainer okay pulled a few of those that's okay we got a Grookey, hashtag Grookey Gang. We got a Spinarak. I suppose we should get the trash cards out of the way first, right? We got a Shinx. I don't know what was happening in our last video, but we could not stop pulling Shinx. And then we got a Reverse Hollow Shinx, I believe. We have a Horsey blowing bubbles your way, hopefully for some Shining Fates luck. And our second to last card in the first booster pack is a Yanma. No, wait, that's not right. Our second to last card in our first booster pack is a Hollow Dragapult. Nice. And the shiny at that. Look at that. Guys, we are on fire today. A shiny in the first card pack. Uh, let's go. All right. Our very last card of our very first Pokemon Shining Fates pack of this Elite Trainer box. I really could have shortened that sentence, couldn't I? Is drum roll, please. I hope I can find some decent drum roll effects. A Crobat V Max. Are you kidding me? We managed to pull this in our last Shining Fates opening, and we now have doubled up on that, guys. I am more than happy with that. That is incredible. I mean, look at the swirls on that bad boy. All right, guys, we are off to a great start. Let's move on to pack number two. All righty, guys, here we have the shiny Dragapult pack. So let's open this without the use of scissors whatsoever. And guys, as you can see, I'm basically a professional opening these cards with my own bare hands. All righty, guys, here is the code card for you guys. Be quick. Okay, so we've got un, de trois, four from the back. All righty, guys, I completely forgot to guess the energy, but there we go. We have Tropius, nice. We are pulling a lot of duplicates of the uh, common cards, but that's okay, that's why they're common cards, right? We have Gym Trainer, again, okay. We have Luxio, I, I don't know what it is with Shinx and Luxray in this set. Gossy Fleur, nice, nice. Cacnea, okay, not gonna lie, bit of a trash card, but we'll get that out of the way. Kufant. Again, very cute baby elephant. I mean, what's not to love about that, guys? Weasel. I think that's the first time we've pulled Weasel from this set. And guys, honestly, I mean, look how chill this guy is. He doesn't have a care in the world. Spinarak. All right, guys, I'm not going to lie to you. Spinarak is a trash card. I do not like pulling it, but we've pulled it. So let's move on. Our second last card of the second pack is a Reverse Hollow Zerude. That is not a bad pull at all. all. right, our last card of the second pack is a drum roll, please. 
a Halloween DD. Indeed, we have pulled that twice now. I'm sorry for the Pokemon puns, guys. It's just the way I am, okay? All right, guys, we're moving on to the Toxtricity pack, our third pack of the day. Here we go. All right, Coco, for you guys, be quick about it. There we go. All right, we've got un, de trois, four from the back. All right, guess the energy. I'm going to go over water energy. Guys, look at us. We are on a roll with this third pack. All right, here we go, here we go. We got Flacky. That is a pretty good first pull. We got Rusted Sword. We got a lot of Rusted Swords. We could probably sell some on eBay, to be fair. I mean, not literally the card. I was making a joke about the actual Rusted Sword, but we don't actually have a Rusted Sword, so that was completely pointless, wasn't it? We got a Rotom. We have a Gossy Fleur. We have a Snom. Okay, I'm not gonna lie, I kind of thought Snom was an ugly, useless Pokemon when I first came across it. It's a little bit cute, okay guys? I'll give it a little bit of credit. We got a Trap Inch. I think that's the first time we pulled it. And guys, look at that artwork. We have a Nickit. We have a Buizel. All right, nice, two Buizels down. Our second last card of this pack is... A shiny car coal. I cannot complain with that guys, it's a shiny. I mean, there are a lot of shiny Pokemon in this set, so hopefully we pull a lot more of these. And our last card of the third pack is, drum roll please. <clears throat> a regular red Dreadnought. Okay guys, I'll take it. I mean, Dreadnought is an absolute beast, so I'm happy with that. Alrighty guys, we have finally reached our very first Charizard pack of the day. Are we going to get some amazing pulls from this? I really, really hope so. Here we go. All right, guys, code card for you guys. Hope you guys get some awesome cards with these code cards. Guys, this is a serious pack, so we're gonna be counting in English. One, two, three, four. All right, we gotta build the suspense, guys. We gotta build the suspense. Alrighty guys, it is a Charizard pack, so I'm gonna guess Fire Energy. Okay, that's not a good start, but here we go. Dartrix, okay, that is not a bad pull. Ball Guy, absolute legend. If you guys have been following my Pokemon Sword series, you'll know that me and him are basically best friends. We have a Cramorant. I think that's the first time we've pulled Cramorant in the set. I mean, Look at that silly goose. We have a Kufant. Can never complain about the Kufant. Let me know if I'm pronouncing that right. Kufant, Kufant. Ah, does it really matter? It probably does. Gossy Fleur. We have a Snob. Okay. We have a Coughing. That's kind of trash, but that's okay. We have a Cacnea. That's kind of trash. So we've pulled two trash cards in a row. We have, is this the second last card? I think this is the second last card. Here we go, guys. Here we go. <gasps> guys, we pulled a Lapras VMAX. Are you kidding me? That is insane. All right, guys, I need to, okay. Chill, Ryan, chill. Ah! All right, the last card of the fourth pack is Celebi. Guys, a Lapras VMAX and a Celebi for our first Charizard pack. That is mind-blowingly good. All right, guys, we are on to our fifth pack. We are officially halfway through the Elite Trainer Box cards. All right, get your code card nice and quickly. We have un, deux, trois, four from the back, and I'm going to guess Psychic Energy for this one. I was wrong. Okay, let's carry on. We've got a Dartrix. We've got a Rusted Shield to go with our Rusted Sword, so we now have a whole collection of Rusted items. Yay. We have a Ball Guy. Guys, we can never have too many of these because this guy is an absolute legend, okay? We have a Shinx. I don't know why, Shinx just will not leave me alone with this set. We have a Coughing. We have a horsey. I'll take a horsey, guys. I'm blowing some bubbles your way for some good luck. We have a Grookey. Hashtag Grookey gang. We have 
A more Pico. I think that's the first time we've pulled more Pico in this set. Oh my goddy gosh, I love the artwork on that. Our reverse holo is a Celebi. Okay, we pulled the regular Celebi and now we have the reverse holo. Guys, that is beautiful. I mean, look at the background on that bad boy. All right, guys. Our last card of the fifth set of our Shining Face Elite Trainer Box is... <gasps> it's a full art ball bite. Are you kidding me? That is insane. Guys, look at how shiny that card is. Oh my good god. I think, I believe that is the first time we have pulled a full art trainer card. Guys, honestly, Lapras VMAX. Full up ball guy, I cannot complain. Alrighty guys, we have our next card pack with the shiny Dragapult artwork, here we go. All right, code card, get your code card right there. All right guys, let's do this, let's do this. Let's get some shiny luck in the house right now. Okay, we have un, deux, trois, four from the back. I'm going to go ahead and get water energy. Okay, hey, that's not a bad sign. We've got a fire energy right off the bat. Here we go. Luxio. Gym trainer. Thwacky. Trash. Weasel. Rowlet. Trap inch. Snom. Guys, Snom's getting on my nerves, I'm not gonna lie. And our second last card of the sixth pack is a reverse hollow horsey. Guys, look at that. Blowing some shiny bubbles your way for good luck. And our very last card of the pack is, strong old please, a hollow fever. That's kind of trash, I'm not going to lie, guys. Alrighty, guys, code card for you, but you got to be quick about it. Okay, here we go, here we go. We've got... Un, deux, trois, four from the back. I'm going to go ahead and guess a psychic energy. Okay, fist bump energy. Here we go, guys. I've got a good feeling about this one. I've got a good feeling. Here we go. All right, we've got a rusted sword. We have way too many rusted swords. We have an Elder Goss. I believe that's the first time we've pulled that from this set. And look at that artwork. That is beautiful. We have a Dartrix. We have a more Pico again. Nice guys, I'm more than happy to double up on more Pico. Look at that little chubby chew. Okay. We have a coughing. We have a glossy fleur. We have a Rowlet. Okay, so we pulled a Rowlet and a Dark Tricks in the same pack. That's pretty cool. We have a Kufant. Kufant? Kufant? I don't know. Our second to last card in this pack is a shiny Arctozolt. Guys, I'm not gonna lie, I've never come across Arctozolt in my life, but that is an amazing looking card right there. And you cannot complain about a shiny Pokemon, okay? All right, guys, here we go. Our last card of the seventh pack of the Elite Trainer Box is, drum roll please, here we go. Boss's orders. No, that, that's great. That's that's really that's a really cool card. Alrighty, guys, we have our shiny Dragapult cover art. Hopefully, bringing us some shining luck. Here we go. Alrighty, guys, here we go. Un, deux, trois, four cards from the back. I'm going to go ahead and guess a steel energy. Okay, this could quite literally be a fire pack. Alright, guys, here we go. Fire energy. Float Soul, just washing out the fire there. Team Yell Tower. Tropius, nice, we've, we've collected quite a few of those, but that's okay. Spinarat. Weasel. A Rowlet. A Trap Inch. I believe we have reached our second last card. Nope, I was wrong. We have a Snob. Okay, guys, how many Snobs are sitting on these benches? All right, guys, our second last card of the pack is 
a reverse holo Morpico. Guys, we pulled it for the first time today and we got the regular and reverse holo. I cannot complain. All right, guys, here we go. Our final card of the pack is... Yan Mega. Cool, 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 cool. Alrighty, guys, second last pack of the Elite Trainer Box. Alright, guys, here is your code card. Nice and slowly for you guys. Alright, here we go. Un, de, trois, four from the back. I'm going to go ahead and guess electric energy. Okay, that's cool. This part. Alright, here we go. Fighting energy, rusted sword. We are now starting our own collection of rusted tools. If you're interested, let me know. Gym trainer. They're very underrated in the games. They're very cool characters. We have a Fwacky. We have another Morpico. Guys, it was it was Shinx last week and now it is Morpico who will not leave us alone. We have a coughing. We have a Gossy Fleur. We have a Rowlet. Oh, next card is a Q fan. Okay, our second last card of our second last pack is a reverse holo Galarian Weezing. Okay, that is not bad at all. And our very last card of the second last pack of the day is Manaphy. Okay, that's a bit of a surprise. I did not even know it was in this set. All right, guys. This is it. I'm going to talk more slowly this time because this is the very last pack of the day. Hey guys, very last code card of the day. I hope you guys get some amazing cards with these. Okay, all right, right. Serious time now, serious time. One, two, three, four from the back. Here we go. Guys, it's a charge pack. We cannot guess anything other than a fire energy. That is not a good start. Here we go. Psychic energy. Elder Goss. Tropius. Ball Guy. Absolute legend. Shinx. Please just leave me alone, Shinx. Please. Coughing. Trap Inch. Rowlet, our second last card of the pack is not here because I mistimed that. That's a tutor. Now, our second last card of the very last pack is a shiny Galarian Darumaka, guys. Look at that bad boy. I mean, guys, come on, I can't complain. It's a shiny Pokemon, okay? Guys, our very last card of the very last pack of the Elite Trainer Box for Shining Fates. I definitely could have condensed that down to a really much shorter sentence. What is... Drum roll, please. Oh, and our creamy VMAX, guys. Oh, what? Guys, I'm just kidding. Don't like, don't break furniture for Pokemon cards. Don't do what I just done, okay? Oh my holy guacamole! That is insane. I think that's the only rainbow rare you can pull from this set. And guys, no way! That is a secret rare. Alrighty guys, those were some insane pulls from the Elite Trainer Box, so I suppose it's time for Ryan's Round Recap of the Day, that was really weird, what? Alright guys, so from the packs today, we obviously got the EV VMAX promo card, which looks absolutely insane. We pulled a shiny Arctozolt, a shiny Carcoal, a shiny Galarian Darumaka, that is quite a mouthful, a shiny Dragapult, a hollow indeed. I don't know why I put that in there to be honest, guys. We pulled another Crobat V Max, that's two now. We pulled a full art ball guy trainer card, which oh man, this guy's an absolute legend. Come on, guys. 
We pulled a Lapras VMAX, which is absolutely beautiful. And if that wasn't good enough, guys, we ended the video today on an Al Creamy VMAX, guys. I mean, that is absolutely insane. What are the chances of pulling that as our very last card of the day? Alrighty, guys, that is gonna do it for today's card opening. Again, because I've run out of Pokemon cards to open, so that is the perfect place to end the video. Guys, as always, if you're enjoying the card opening or the Pokemon Sword Let's Play videos, make sure to smash that like button. If you are new to the channel, make sure to click the subscribe button for more awesome Pokemon content. Guys, as always, thank you so, so much to every single person that takes the time to watch my videos. It really does mean a lot to me. Guys, I hope you have an amazing rest of your weekend and goodbye.